idea and all that, but those gladiators are like super tough. And I don't know how Tim pulled off beating them, but okay, look, for real, I don't think I could do that. Like, max level scariness, okay? Boo! Oh, no, I mean totally OP. I'm not sure how Tim pulled off defeating the gladiators. Their fists are huge, their weapons are super scary. Uh, where's Jesse going with this? But you know what I am sure of? If we combine all our fists and stuff, we're gonna be even tougher than the gladiators, even tougher than Tim! Oh, I get it now. If we work together as a team, That's very oddly inspiring. Yeah! Look, it was a nice speech. But strength doesn't come from speeches. Actions speak louder than words. Can't expect you to just talk your way through this, Jesse. Strength comes from believing in yourself, Em. Sounds like a bunch of nonsense, Jesse. Sorry. Man, some crowd. Think they got through to him? Wait, so who are we fighting then? <sighs> Reaction definitely seemed mixed. Yeah, no kidding. A lot of diehard Tim fans. We're doomed. I don't know how we're gonna pull this off. What? Of course we're gonna pull this off. You're Jesse. Yeah, we can still do this. Well, I guess we'll find out for sure in the morning. Ah. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, it is my privilege, nay, my honor, to be here today, kicking off another wonderful day of the game. That's right, Adrian, and not just any day, but the final day of the game. Are our competitors ready for the final challenge? The it's walls. The walls. So, scared? Because it's okay if you are. No one will judge you for it. You can tell me if you were scared. After putting up with your breath this whole walk? Please. This walls thing doesn't scare me at all. <laughs> Still got your sense of humor, huh? Cute. Mavia, for those unfamiliar with the walls, you want to walk us through how it's played? Sure thing, Hadrian. Teams start out separated in their own sections, divided by the high inner walls. Each team has a short amount of time to gather materials, build defenses, and craft in their section before the walls come yeah. down. Wait, I only see dirt and gravel in my section. Oh, I'm sorry. Is that going to be a problem? The sections are drawn at random. Uh, yeah, didn't you hear them? I need to gather up things to build defenses, craft tools, and... And you don't care at all, do you? Nope. Awesome. Once the walls are down, it's every team for themselves. But is surviving the walls the end, Mevia? No, it is not, Hadrian. Whichever team survives the free-for-all needs to step onto the winner's platform in the center of the arena. Winner takes all! But let's not get ahead of ourselves, because that's only if the would-be winners can defeat... Oh. Gladiators! <laughs> that's right! So all competitors better get to gathering materials because that clock is ticking! Too dark. Well, hopefully it's not all dirt and gravel. Adrian, I can't help but notice that our newcomer Jesse's section has a disproportionate amount of dirt and gravel. Oh, funny how the universe works. Like it's all part of a plan. Nope, a just deal. dirt. Come on! That's hilarious! I'm guessing that's the eponymous wall. Gravel? Gravel, that's worse than dirt! At least they gave me a crafting table. Now, if only I actually...
actually had anything to craft with. Hey! <laughs> Seems like they're happy you didn't get anything. <laughs> I think they're making fun of you. But just my, you know, professional opinion. As a gladiator. Who's heard this a lot? Nah. Oh my gosh, do you really think so? That's terrible. Oh, wow, I mean, yeah. C could you not tell? I hate you. Oh, do you know what time it is? Ask me what time it is, Mavia. What time is it, Hadrian? It's time for the walls to come down! Uh, this should be interesting. There. The competitors are like wild ocelots, sizing each other up, unmoving, before they go in for the kill. Really? Looks like the gladiator formerly known as Emily is preparing her attack. And Jeffy, the newcomer, is just painfully unarmed and unprotected. Jesse. This could get ugly. Okay, do whatever it is you have to do. Whatever you say. Jesse isn't even trying to defend himself. Here it comes! The finish! <gasps> Figured I'd try believing in myself for once and take a chance. It appears Emily has opted to Thank not you, you made the right decision. The well, you could and say you really inspired me. Oh, well, that could, but don't. This isn't how it was supposed to go. What's going on? I have no idea. Come on, over here. Yeah, why aren't you all killing each other? Yeah, man, I can totally see why you'd be confused. Yeah, we're, uh, confused. I mean, usually the little teams all kill each other, you know? Aren't you tired of letting the old builders use you like this? Like, uh, like awesome people? No, like little pieces in their games, doing whatever they say. Don't you see? None of us are the enemy. It's them! They're the enemies. They're behind everything. Oh, my head hurts. Too many perspectives. And it appears that Jesse has decided that deals don't need to be kept and is trying to convince the gladiators to follow suit. These aren't your games anymore, Hadrian. Uh, uh, th these weren't our games? Wow, my urge to destroy is dissipating. Go, oh, imbeciles! Lab? What should we do? Uh, uh, uh. I'm sure that the slaughter will commit soon, right? You're all such strong, amazing fighters. You could fight the old builders. Defeat them. No way. I am very strong, but not strong enough for that. <laughs> yep, that is some straight crazy talk. Not going with them, Slab? In my life, I've done some things I'm not proud of. But I won't work for bosses who use people or manipulate them. That's inconsiderate. But you, when I was mean to you, pushed you around and made you go to the tower with me, you got that I was just doing my job and came anyway so we could be on time. That was real considerate. I will fight the old builders by your side. I think it's time for us to finish this together! It appears all the competitors are headed towards the victory platform. As stated in our rules, anyone who is not eliminated may step on the victory platform and win the games. It looks like they are going to do this together. Right behind you, fearless leader. Hey, two slab. You'll pay for that. This wasn't the deal, Jesse. No, no! And they've done it! The competitors have all stepped onto the platform together, which, by the Builder Game Bylaws, means they are all the winners! Which I'm sure my colleague means to say, we are going to find some way to disqualify them? No, we are not! They all win! Uh, no! 
Clavia, Otto, with me. We're ending this. We had a deal, and you broke it, bucko! We had an agreement! You promised me! And to think we let you compete! You should be ashamed of yourselves manipulating all these people like this! How dare you! This isn't up to you! We control the games! We decide their outcome! Mevia... Shut up, Otto! So you admit the games are rigged, then? <laughs> sure! Okay, sure, fine, whatever! Mevia... Jesse won these games fair and square. He's earned the Atlas. Otto, I would think very carefully about what you're doing. I have. Jesse... With the power vested in me as an officiator of the Builder Games, I am proud to pay. Uh, what are you doing? Now it's been fun, really, but I think it's about time we end this. Whoa, this is majorly bogus, dudes. Surrender the Redstone Heart now, now, because uh, I will trap you here forever. You want the Redstone Heart? You're gonna have to pick it out of my inventory. Fine by me. The hard way's more fun anyway. Ah! Oh, this is useless! Well, well. Just M, come back! Now that you've lost your oversized friend, you really don't stand a chance. Run away, little Emily. I'm still with you, Jesse. Thank you. You're gonna need all the help you could get, Jesse. Time to take what is mine. I'll admit you're quick sport, but not quick enough for my axe. Oh, what the? Don't forget my axe, Hadrian. No. <laughs> uh. <laughs> no, slab. It was an honor to fight with you. Gotta admit, kid, you've shown you got skills, but you're still no we'll match. see about that. I got this, Hadrian. Had enough, Hadrian? Wait, wait! You're right. It's gone too far. It was just supposed to be a game. You expect me to believe that? Come on, sport. Haven't you ever had anything get away from you before? I mean, can't you forgive me? <laughs> <sighs> This game is no! And that's our game, sports fans. The Redstone Heart has been returned to its proper owners. <laughs> I I lost. Hey, fancy meeting you here. You know. I've sent hundreds of competitors to these respawn pits. Never knew it hurt so much. Sorry. That's probably not helping your mood right now. It's over. I... Oh, I don't think so. It's us. Yeah. I'm so happy to see you guys. You said you believed in me, Jesse. Figured I'd return the favor and believe in everyone else. You know, because I'm awesome. And we both need to get out of this. Oh, I knew you'd be back. Thanks for not doubting me. But I lost my inventory when I respawned. How am I supposed to get the Atlas back without any weapons or armor or anything? Well, we may have made a little stop in Hadrian's inventory room and helped ourselves to a few things. Awesome. Here, buddy. Wow. Take this. Thanks. Hey, suspenders. Over here. Tim's armor. Belongs to you now. Time to kick some old builder butt! Now to pick a weapon to go with my sweet new armor. Ooh, yeah, nice choice. Bad. Sweet. Payback ah, time! Now what should we do with all those other competitors who betrayed us? Well, Mevia, spending eternity in the quartz mines doesn't seem like punishment enough. <laughs> I have something special in mind for them. Hadrian! Mevia! This game just went into overtime! Well, isn't that cute? You found Tim's armor! 
Oh, well, isn't that just the sweetest thing, Hadrian? I'm gonna make you beg me for a deal. Seems unlikely. We don't beg sport. Oh, I'm gonna enjoy crushing you. is going to help? You're deluded! Let's take him to the slab land. By far. Uh, I'm, I'm still workshopping that one. Shut up. Let's go. Jesse, let's talk about this. Hmm, is that begging? Does that sound like begging to you, Petra? It sure does, Jesse. Told you. Shut up. Just shut up. Alia, shut up. I see you don't like having a live audience, Adrian. Come on! Jesse! Remember Spleef! Got it. Now, Mevia, we have to get out of here. Come on! Whoa, whoa, hey, hey, guys. How's it going? <laughs> it's going not the best, and you're not going anywhere. Yeah. Face Meat wants to discuss his benefits plan. Oh, hang on, hang on! Jesse, you did it! Again. Feels like I say that a lot. I couldn't have done anything without all of you. Well done, Jesse. An excellent job. Uh, thanks, Otto. You have truly shown my friends and I the error of our ways. I'm glad to put this whole messy business behind us. Man, do you need some new friends, you know that? Yes, I have come to that same conclusion, and I am working on it. I also know that the Atlas is not mine to keep. You have fairly defeated them. Seems only fair that you get to decide their fate. And with the Atlas, you can send them anywhere you want. Hmm. You know, there was this game that Olivia and I used to play back in our treehouse. Huh? Remember? We called it, Which Would You Rather Fight? And that's when I yanked Pama's redstone heart right out. The whole thing shut down. Man, you guys have had some crazy adventures. So many people trying to kill you. Goodbye, Jesse. Goodbye. Thank you. Is that all of them? Everyone that wants to go home anyhow. Except you folks, that is. I can't believe how many competitors actually want to stay and keep playing the games. Thanks to you, my intrepid new friend, I can actually work on making them fun again. Very exciting. It'll be more challenging just by myself. 
but a good challenge. You promised they'll stay fun this time, right? Oh, yes. I don't intend to let the games get corrupted like they did before. And I'm gonna help, too. You taught me a lot about fairness, Jesse. And I'd like to use that new knowledge for something good. Oh, and speaking of fairness, I think this is yours. Oh, man. There was some good stuff in there. I was really moved. Awesome. Huh. I guess he wasn't so immovable after all. Well, Em, how about you? You said you wanted to go home, right? Yes, I just can't decide if it's what I want. You get to leave and go on more adventures. Do I really want to go back to farming? I mean, it has been ages since I've seen it, and I miss my friends, but what if I'm bored? Well, if you want, you can come with us. Oh, really? Like, really? Yeah, we could always use another awesome person, and... Well, you're pretty awesome. Ah, oh, Jesse! That's wonderful! Oh, thank you so much! Hey, Ivor. Oh, hello! What you doing? I was just observing Harper. All by herself, over there. She seems lonely. Come on. Hey, Harper. Oh, hey, Jesse, Ivor. I was just watching folks head on home. Things really worked out, huh? Well, I guess this is goodbye. I'm gonna head on back to Crown Mesa and see how the Post Palma construction is going. Just hope they'll take me back. It's not my real home, but it's the closest thing I've had for, well, a long time. We'll just go with that. It probably won't be easy, Harper. I hope you're ready to work hard. Oh, I am. What I did? I'll be very grateful if they can forgive me someday. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. Getting over the I was a bad guy hump can be awkward, but hopefully soon they'll invite you right back into their lives. Right, Jesse? You are a strange, strange man, Ivor. But you know something? You're okay. Take care of each other, all right? And I'll see you around. Bye, Harper. Yes, goodbye. Come on. You're amazing. So, how do we get home now? Well, the Atlas belongs to Jesse now. The deal's a deal and all that. Sweet. Uh, how does it work? Now you just say where you want to go, and the Atlas will show you the way. Why don't you just go ahead and open it? Okay, Book. Take us home. Whoa! Spectacular! Incredible! Nice! There it is. Home. I assume M told you that she's coming with? Yeah, she's already promised to show me that awesome spin move. It's not so great. Figure it's about time we get heading on home, huh? That sounds awesome. Yeah! Home, here we come. Jesse, look! Can you believe it? We made it! We're home! After all that time, all those portals, we're home! Yes, it does feel pretty good, doesn't it? Yeah, and I couldn't have done it without you guys. You're the best team anyone could ever ask for. Aw. That's... lovely. Ah, you big sap. 
I'm just so glad we're all back together. That atlas is so cool. I'm glad Otto let you keep it. Fabulous. Yes! And that's not all we got. Seriously? What else did you get? Yeah. Show him, Jesse. The crown of the Eversource. The magical source of all of Sky City's precious materials. Whoa, wicked! The Portal Atlas. I could have lost all the rest so long as we got to keep that. Ha! Huh? I wonder what Soren would have thought of it. So much power contained within such a tiny Whoa. object. Easy there, Ivor. Mm. Sorry. The mask of Cassie Rose, a.k.a. the White Pumpkin. Oh, man. That's even creepier looking than I imagined. The Enchanted Flint and Steel. The one that started the whole thing. Yeah, none of these other adventures could have happened if it weren't for this. Palma's Redstone Heart. I know that Palma was evil and everything, but I still kind of wish I could have seen it. I can't believe you got to do all those incredible things. Makes sense, though. You were gone a long time. Wait till we show you all the improvements we've been making to town. Um, Jesse? What's up, Lucas? So, I've been writing stuff in here, you know? And, well, it's kind of become like a legitimate book. But there's just one problem. I still need to put what happened to you. You've, well, you've been the hero of this whole story. It wouldn't be right to end it without saying what happened to the hero. Oh man, well you want people to finish the book feeling really excited, right? So you should do something awesome. Something like, uh, the Order of the Stone returned. Mighty warriors who had vanquished evil from the land. All lands! Okay, it's a little more grandiose than my usual style, but <laughs> I like it. There, done. Well, tell the next one, anyway. I was thinking that maybe we could put it in here with the other treasures. I know it's not as cool as, like, a portal atlas or a redstone heart, but it did kind of become a book about our whole adventure. That's a great idea, Lucas. It's perfect. Hang on. What is it? Wasn't that where the portal atlas was a minute ago? Yeah, that was definitely where you put it. Guys, flint and steel are missing too. And where's Ivor? He must be headed for the portal network. Is that bad? What should we do? I mean, I guess he mostly knows what he's doing. That's all right. He went on just as epic a journey as the rest of us. If he wants to dive right back into the portal network, well, I think he's earned it by this point. So you think we should just let him go? Yeah, I do. Come on, guys. Let's go home. <laughs>